Hey everyone, I got a job interview in Phoenix, which is like a six hour drive. We're gonna go, uh, we're gonna go to Walmart, get some stuff before we leave. Yeah, they ain't helping anybody. Okay, that guy's never held a beer or a football in his life. This kid doesn't look trustworthy. Looking like the little boy version of Kathy Griffin up there. It's a little racist to put a basketball in a black kid's hand. It's racist, at least in ads. This is the bullied section. These kids need to be bullied. These kids are probably booger eaters. Fucking booger eaters, dude. What kind of pussy kid needs calming vibrations, dude? You're a pussy. I don't like how happy these kids are to be wearing training underwear. Take it easy, you're not that great. You're still pissing yourself. It's no different than diapers. We just call it training underwear, okay? Seriously, I could take these kids any day of the week in a holding my pee contest. I'm better than them at holding my pee. They suck, they should stop acting like they're cool. I don't wear training pants, I wear regular underwear, so. I packed my suit up, got an interview tomorrow. We're gonna try and get this job. You know, gotta make money. I've been driving for a couple hours. I'm already pretty hungry. And I'm desperate. Which means I gotta go with uh, Taco Bell. I'm not happy about it. I should have been prepared. I should have prepped a sandwich. But uh, I wasn't prepared. So now we deal with Taco Bell. Maybe we'll do a food review thing. You guys like food reviewers? Food reviewer. I do reviews on the YouTube. You never knew such a cool dude. I keep it so fly. And you know why? Because I know whether to buy that food. Hey guys, it's your food reviewer. Uh, today we're at Taco Bell. And we're going to try out the new Taco Bell uh, slip and slide. Uh, let's check it out. See if it's to buy. Okay, he spilled a bunch of cheese all over my, my car because they didn't wrap it well. Look, this is cheese right here. There's cheese. There's some cheese. God damn it, there's cheese in the bag. Here we go. It's Taco Bell Shippers Life. Check it out. Okay. The Taco Bell slip and slide is pretty good. You can taste the crispy. You can taste the crunchy. There's also some cheesy and beefy in there. Okay? I say the Taco Bell slip and slide, it's a buy. Alright, uh, about to go into my first interview here. I'm dressed up for senior pictures. Wish me luck, and uh, we'll be back. So, uh, I think the interview went well. I think I, I did a good job. I think they loved me. I think they want to be roommates now. But we'll find out. We'll find out! Alright, so we found out, and uh, they said no. Uh, so no, I'm not getting that job in Arizona, but I do have an interview here in Dallas, so now I'm going to fly to Dallas. I don't even know if I want to live in Texas. I'm just going to go check it out, see if I like it. Let's go. Alright, I just landed in Dallas. Ah, I'm here for a job interview. I didn't pack anything. I just wore my suit on the plane, wore jeans, and then I put my suit pants in my computer bag. You know, just because Spirit charges you $8,000 per carry-on. So, you know, I'm flying back tomorrow. I don't have PJs. I just sleep in, uh, in the nude or in the underwears or my suit. Sometimes I just sleep in the suit. I might just do it so I'm ready.
I've heard many things about Whataburger. I don't even remember if they're good or bad. I just know the name. It's popular, so we're gonna do another food reviewer segment. All right, guys, we're here with another food review. Whataburger in Texas. This is your one. It's called the uh, Trash Burger. They take the buns apart and they take the garbage can and just dump whatever's in there on the buns. It's, it's supposed to be the pretty good burger. So, uh, let's try it out. It's a pretty good garbage burger. I just arrived to my motel. I specifically asked for a giant picture of boots on the wall, and I got it. I'm pretty stoked. I'm gonna be sleeping below a picture of boots. For some reason, there's a full kitchen with a couch. I don't know why. Man, it even has a space for a fridge and a dishwasher. I should have brought my fridge and dishwasher. for my interview. I'm not sure if I want to live in Texas. I don't know how I feel about this. We're gonna see how the job goes, or the interview goes. All right, so I just got done uh, with the interview. I'm gonna be honest, I don't feel great about it. Don't feel great about that interview. So the job hunt continues, unless I get a call, but it ain't happening, guys. Mm -hmm. 